சீக்ரெட் எதுவுமே கிடையாது ஆனால் வணக்கங்க எல்லோரும் நல்லா இருக்கீங்களா ரொம்ப டைம் ஆகிடுச்சு வந்து ஸோ ரொம்ப எக்ஸைட்டடாக இருக்கேன் ஓகே எல்லோரும் சாப்பிட்டு எல்லோரும் ஹாப்பி ஹாப்பியாக இருக்கீங்கன்னு பேச முடியும் ஸோ இந்த சீக்ரெட்லாம் ஒன்றும் இல்லை இதுதான் எதுவுமே இல்லைங்க ஜஸ்ட்டு ஸ்டோரி கேட்பேன் ஸ்டோரி கேட்டுட்டு டைரக்டர் டீம் ட்ரஸ்ட் பண்ணுவேன் ட்ரஸ்ட் பண்ணிட்டு எனக்கு கையில் எதுவுமே கிடையாது ஸோ ஜஸ்ட் அது ஒரு ட்ரெஸ்ட் அது ஒரு ட்ரஸ்ட்டு அது ஒரு சாய்ஸ் அது ஒரு டிசிஷன் பண்ணது ஒரு ஓகே ட்ரெய்லர் பார்க்கும்போது ஒரு பக்கம் வந்து பார்த்தீங்கன்னா பயங்கர இன்டென்ஸாக வந்து அவரோட ஆக்டிங் இருக்கு ரன்பீர் கபூரோட ஆக்டிங் நீங்கள் அந்த கொஞ்ச பாட்லேயும் உங்களுக்கு பயங்கரமாக அந்த ஒரு ஃபியூ சீன்ஸே வந்து பார்த்தீங்கன்னா அவ்வளோ இன்டென்ஸாக இருக்கு ராஷ்மிகாவை எவ்வளோ பப்ளியா எல்லாம் நம்ம பார்த்துருக்கோம் ஸோ இந்த இன்டென்சிட்டி எந்த அளவுக்கு சேலஞ்சிங்காக இருந்தது என்னாச்சுன்னா ஒரு சாரி கேமரா சாரி பார்க்கறேன் பார்க்கறேன் சுவாமி ஓகே என்னாச்சுன்னா ஒரு பெரிய இன்டென்ஸ் சீனில் வந்து த மோஸ்ட் இன்டென்ஸ் எக்ஸ்பிரஷன் எடுத்து எடுத்துட்டு வந்து ட்ரெய்லரில் உடைசே வச்சுருக்காங்க வச்சிருக்காங்க ஓகே ஸோ அது பார்த்துட்டு சடனாக ஓகே வாட் இஸ் ஹேப்பனிங்னு யூ ஸ்டார்ட் திங்கிங் லைக் தேட் பட் அஃப்கோர்ஸ் த ட்ரெய்லர் ஹேஸ் டு ஸ்டே சே அ ஸ்டோரி ஆன் இட் செல் ஸோ அதுக்கு தான் லைக் த எக்ஸ்பிரஷன்ஸ் ஆர் சீமிங் ஸோ இன்டென்ஸ் பட் இட் ஆல்சோ லைக் வென் யூ வாட்ச் த மூவி யூ அண்டர்ஸ்டாண்ட் இட் பெட்டர் ஸோ ஐம் வெயிட்டிங் ஃபார் த மூவி டு ரிலீஸ் அண்ட் நீங்கள் பார்த்துட்டு நீங்கள் சொல்லுங்கள் சூப்பர் சார் தேங்க்யூ நிறைய கொஸ்டின்ஸ் அங்கேருந்து வரும் ஸோ அதனால் ஐ இல் கட் மை டைம் யூர் ஓகே ஸோ நெக்ஸ்ட் வெரி குட் நமஸ்தே குட் ஆஃப்டர்நூன் வணக்கம் இட்ஸ் ரியலி அ பிளேஸ் டு பி பேக் இன் சென்னை ஐ ஃபர்ஸ்ட்லி ஓன் டு கங்க்ராச்சுலேட் யூ கைஸ் ஃபார் Uh, an amazing year again at in the uh, indian film industry i think three of my favorite films uh, made in india in the last one and a half years has been from the tamil film industry that being jailer leo and uh, vikram so congratulations on that um, like sir had mentioned that you know sandeep and the entire team has worked really hard in the dubbing of this film uh, to make it seem like a film that the tamil speaking audience will really enjoy तो वो रीमेक की नौबत नहीं होगी दैट यू डोंट हैव टू मेक अ रीमेक ऑफ दिस फिल्म सी दिस फिल्म एज एन ओरिजिनल एंड वेरी एक्साइटेड टू बी हियर एंड टू प्रेजेंट आवर फिल्म एनिमल रिलीजिंग ऑन फर्स्ट ऑफ दिसंबर ओके एंड यू हैव योर ओन स्टाइल ऑफ वर्किंग एज रशवा स्टेलिंग इन अनदर प्रमोशन वीडियो दैट यू आस्क द एक्टर आल्सो वेदर इट्स ओके टू रिहर्स और यू डायरेक्टली एक्ट सो इन दैट वे दिस मूवी इज सो सो इंटेंस सो डू यू हैव दैट स्विच ऑन एंड ऑफ button like because do you carry the emotional thing which you have acted to home or you easily switch off how is that no no you have to switch off that's your skill as an actor being a professional if you ask this face the camera if sir. you ask this question to bobby sir he's to playing the antagonist the villain if he went home like that his family would throw him <laughs> out <laughs> you know so you have to really know where to draw the line uh, but like i've been mentioning it in a lot of my interviews now is that uh, when i was starting this film i uh, uh, became a father uh, at the same time so it was uh, it was quite strange to go and play this part and then go home to my beautiful daughter uh but i could really differentiate between both the experiences between real life and real life uh, welcome to chennai again thank you yeah this is about uh, you said earlier i've not done a complex role like this earlier and what was the preparation you did for this role i think ma'am what i usually do uh, every actor has their own process my process has always been that i spend a lot of time with the director and thankfully in this case yeah, the director is also the writer so i think first and foremost it's very important that i understand the meaning of what he's writing what is his idea behind the scene behind the story behind these characters so once you start understanding that uh it's really like a love story between you and your director you know you have to fall in love with each other so you can really trust each other and you can really do something magical uh yes it's the most complex character not just for me i think for every actor who's been on part of this journey uh every character is so complex because sandeep has uh worked so hard on writing the characters in such a real way you know why you like films like his films like arjun reddy and kabir singh is because he shows you something which is very real but he does it in a very cinematic filmy way so everybody can relate to it the youth can especially relate to certain characters and the dynamics hello uh 
Swami, I mean, I read this Bharat from. Uh, Sorry, I just want to finish the. Uh, you, you, yeah. <laughs> um, so yeah, it's 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 a complex film. Every character is very complex, and I think that's what the audience is really enjoy is to see uh, every character go through a certain graph, you know, a beginning, middle, and end, and that will be very exciting for the viewers. Thank you. But it's more kind of a metro kind of a set wherein like it will be a little too dramatic, but here it is raw, real, rugged. and plenty of actions i mean it's more like a south indian i mean the films that we grew up watching one now how did you adjust to that and secondly there is a uh, easy gamble going for a uh, mom son relationship mere paas mahe is very famous even today we just get up hearing that dialogue and what is the gamble in going for this dad son relationship uh, i think to answer your first question i think uh, the conviction came from the director I think Sandeep Reddy Wanga is somebody who is very original. He is one of the most original filmmakers I've met because whatever he was narrating to me, us on set, we never had any reference to it. Usually, you know, when you're making a movie, somebody gives you a scene. Okay, this is the emotion. You think, "Acha, in this film, this had happened." You think of a, a South Indian film, a Hindi film, a Hollywood film. But in this film, whatever he was narrating, everything seems so original that we all were very inspired to, you know, do something very original. so the all the credit goes to the director sandeep and to answer your second question yes you are right uh, you know the, especially in hindi movies we really uh, tap uh, into the uh, mother son relationship a lot uh, you know even if we've seen films like say a kgf you know which has the mother son emotion uh, but i think this father son emotion was something which inspired sandeep to write this story he told me uh, the first time i met him i i asked him i said why did you think of the story and how did you think of the story he's saying i thought of the story starting with only one thin line is that where would the obsession a son has for his father where would it drive him to what would it drive him to to what kind of extremes what would he do to protect his loved ones uh where would he go in 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 his mind in his actions and i think that was a very interesting take on on a father son relationship the obsession between father and son um so that was very exciting to be a part of Ranbir, congrats to Animal. Say few words about our Tamil audience. Well, uh, you know uh, the films and the culture that the Tamil audiences has been having over the years. We've seen videos of how you all celebrate cinema, how you all celebrate music, how you all celebrate your your heroes and your heroines and everything. And I think that's very inspiring to watch. You know, as a as as an actor, uh, somebody who aspires for that. When you see Rajni sir's entry, or when you see the. telepathy vijay sir is all uh, all the great stars you know kamal hasan sir um, ajit sir you know you see uh, uh, you see that you know their audience and their fans they support them so much they love them so much they love the culture of cinema and movies so much and i think that's very inspiring and i think oh, everywhere in the world i think the 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 tamil root the audience is a very strong base out here and that's that's very nice thank you rashmika tamil industry telugu industry now hindi industry எப்படி இருக்கு சொல்லுங்க வாட் இஸ் த ரோல் யூ பிளேட் அனிமல் சாரி தமிழ் தெலுங்கு ஹிந்தி இண்டஸ்ட்ரி எப்படி இருக்கு உங்களோட வர்க் எக்ஸ்பீரியன்ஸ் அனிமல்ல என்ன ரோல் ப்ளே பண்ணிருக்கீங்க தமிழ் தெலுங்கு ஹிந்தி கன்னட ஏ இண்டஸ்ட்ரி ஒரு வயசு எல்லா இண்டஸ்ட்ரி டிஃப்ரெண்ட் டீம்ஸோடு வேலை பண்ணிட்டப்போ டிஃப்ரென்ஸ் இருக்க இருக்கு மேம் ஆனால் இண்டஸ்ட்ரியோட டிஃப்ரென்ஸ் எதுவுமே பார்க்கல ஈ ஃபிலிமில் வந்து கீதாஞ்சலி கேரக்டர் வந்து ஐ திங்க் கீதாஞ்சலி அண்டர்ஸ்டாண்ட்ஸ் த ஹீரோ பெட்டர் தேன் எனி ஒன் எல்ஸ் பெட்டர் தேன் ஹிஸ் மதர் ஹிஸ் ஃபாதர் ஹிஸ் கசின்ஸ் பெட்டர் தென் எனி ஒன் எல்ஸ் கீதாஞ்சலி அண்டர்ஸ்டாண்ட்ஸ் த ஹீரோ அண்ட் ஷீ இஸ் க்ரோன் அப் வித் ஹிம் and she is married to him and she has the children he is the father of her children so i think like she is one um grounding factor in his life but also for a geetanjali character nothing else matters in her life more than her husband so i think that is the beauty in the film see again all these emotions um uh, you can't speak about these emotions you should just watch it so probably after the release i'll have better things to say and more things to say and i po and i think the only thing i can say is this is the most intense character that i have played in my life as an actor 
and it's the most real character without any sugar coating or without any sort of filter this is the most raw character that i've played in my life so i'm very excited to get more roles like this congratulations thank, thank you thank you hello mr ranbir uh, yeah also hello one mr thing. ranbir uh, sorry sorry i no. cut you off sorry you know so, uh, ma'am you know how i explain my character in this film i keep saying that i'm the zoo keeper for all the animals <laughs> Hello, Mr. Ranbir. Shalini here. Did you finish? Hi, Shalini. Ah, uh, Shalini here, and welcome back to Chennai. Thank you. Actually, parents versus kid. Uh, there will be a natural love, actually. So we don't need to any efforts or uh, that. So in this movie, uh, the obsessed love want father. Did you have any doubts on that in the script in the initial stage? No, no, no doubt at all. I actually, I think uh, most of, uh, especially the Indian, uh, uh, the, the Indian males, they always have some form of conflict with their father. You know, there is always this this distance. You know, because it's there's so much of respect, but there is also fear. So I think the father-son emotion, especially in India, is something which is uh, very sensitive and it's not tapped into too much. So I think this film will really tap into that uh, uh, very interestingly. So I'm really looking forward to that. So another question. Uh, actually, obsessed love want father. Is that bad or good? What is going to project in this movie? I think any kind of obsession is not healthy. Uh, you know, sometimes there are some deep-rooted childhood scars that you have which remain. That's why you have the obsession. Everybody loves their parents. You know, nobody does not love their parents. But I think obsession is something which can get very unhealthy. In this film, of course, he's an obsessive lover of his father. He's somebody who is obsessed. Uh, but that also made a very interesting movie out of him. You know, that character became interesting because of that obsession. So that's okay for the movies. I'm not sure if that's okay for real life. You know, that's too much obsession for real life. Thank you for your answer. Anbirji, uh, this is Gar Karthik Viral Aval Cinema. Hello, Karthik, sir. Uh, one question. Yes. Uh, Appa Paya Sentiment, uh, Father Son Sentiment. Uh, and the name title on the animal. This is the name of the animal. What animal is the name? Madam, please translate. <laughs> what, what kind of one animal? It's a dad son sentiment, yeah, yeah. but why animal? Uh, because I think, animal? I think you're seeing this film through the perspective of this character, which is the character I play, and other characters which I can't speak about. You should, once you see the film, you'll understand. But I think the reason why Sandeep Reddy Wanga called this film animal is that animals behave out of instinct. They don't behave out of thought. So this character uh, that I'm playing, he behaves out of instinct. To protect his family, he's not thinking. He's behaving out of instinct. He's impulsive. I think that's where the title Animal came. And once you see the film, you realize, huh, this film suits this title, you know. Okay. Another one question. Bobby Diol, Anil Kapoor, you only have one question. You only. Bobby Diol, Anil Kapoor, you only have the limelight on the Aunga Mali in Podong. So since you are sharing the screen with the other big stars, hmm. so they will also get the space. So how do you see that? I think so. So far I have not done any mass movie. I have never got any mass moments. And it's usually when you work with actors like Mr. Bobby Dole, Mr. Anil Kapoor, who are so accomplished in, 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 in making movies of this genre. Uh, you get their fans to come and watch you also because they are coming to watch them. So sometimes you have to piggyback on 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 on, on actors and, and 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 big stars so that you know you can also grow your audience. Uh, but yes, it's it's I think one of the first for me. So I hope that the audience accepts me. Bobby, ask me one more question. You in the Mary multi language all mandring hai. South Indian hero soda nadi ke rupa comfortable feel mandring la. In the Mary North Indian hero soda nadi ke rupa comfortable feel mandring la. அதுக்குரியாசிங்ஸ்டேஜ்ரேட் பீப்புள் சோ I am so feeling super honored and I'm really grateful for what has life offered me. Um so for me I feel like every opportunity that I get I feel like I'm blessed. So I'm just having fun 
I'm just praying God and thanking God. I'm being super grateful because of the, all the love that I receive in every language or every state that I go to. Um, so I'm just grateful, sir. <laughs> yeah, there's no like, okay, different heroes or different directors. It's not that. Hi. Uh, uh, welcome to Chennai. Thank you. Uh, during the course of the speech, uh, the technicians from the South on the said that, you know, they've canned uh, uh, a wonderful action sequence for the film. And we're kind of curious. It, it kind of looks impressive as well. Uh, and during the course of the speech, they said that, you know, the gun that they've fashioned uh, is never been fashioned before. It's almost 500 kgs. We see you operating the uh, weapon in the screen. I think you would have required some amount of effort to kind of, you know, operate it. Because ideally, a weapon like a machine gun is difficult to handle. And something that heavy would have required quite a bit of effort. Could you tell us a little more about how you made the effort? Well, uh, I, I remember the first time uh, Suresh Anna showed us the, the, the bike and the gun, which was this, this new, what would you call it? A, a gun bike, sir? A bike gun? A war machine. War machine. We were like shocked, you know, how did he imagine this? It was amazing and he did it from scratch, you know, it's such an original piece. Uh, it was a great idea that Sandeep and Suresh Anna had and I think when, uh, when you're acting for movies, you're not really shooting the gun. So you have to pretend and you have to have the imagination that if you're operating a machine which is so heavy and large, what would that do to your body? You know, what would that do to your ears? Because you're, you're shooting, you're shooting for hours. Uh, so that, uh, I really had to imagine that because of course the bullets are coming in CG, it's not in real. Uh, that's the magic of the movies. But I think just the idea was so fascinating, the, the creation was so amazing that uh, I just feel lucky, you know, that I have an image like that of shooting a gun like that. One, I think that was Sandeep's idea. When he uh, uh, told me this, I said, sir, please don't. I don't consider myself as a superstar and in our Hindi cinema, we don't do this. He said, no, I look at you like this, so I'm going to present you like this. So it was his idea. I also must tell you that our set was such a uh, multicultural set because we had Hindi speaking actors, Punjabi speaking actors, Malayalam, Kannada, Tamil, Telugu. I think we had the entire language of everybody in India speaking on our set. And especially Supreme Sir because he speaks very less English and Hindi. But we, had, uh, we, we just could understand each other because there was so much of love and so much of inspiration and so much of understanding uh, uh, that, you know, it, it, it was really heartwarming to see a set like that which had so many languages and cultures. Hi, thank uh, you, Ranbir thank sir. you. I think we oh, are You had a question? Yes, thank sir. you so much. Who had? Yes, uh, uh, that sir is saying over over. Sir, this is Surya from JRTV. Sir, uh, after the COVID, we will create more pan-Indian movies. Do you think pan-Indian movies is our future? Uh, there is no like Bollywood or uh, uh, Kollywood, uh, no suppression. It, it will create uh, uh, only movie, it called only Indian movie like that. Of course, I think it's such a healthy trend that is starting because this is Indian cinema. We all are, uh, you know, people from India and we are making cinema for each other. Of course, we have so many different languages, so many different cultures, but a good story will break every language barrier. We've seen that with Bahubali, we've seen that with KGF, we've seen that with uh, Robot, you know, we've seen that with so many films and uh, say even a film like Jawan, which released right now, which did so well in the South market. So I think a good story will appeal to a larger audience. We as filmmakers, as actors, we just have to choose the right subjects. And we hope that, you know, we are all part of entertainment. We want to entertain as many people as possible. Uh, so with Animal, I hope that it, we are releasing it in, you know, so many languages. The, the director and the team have really worked hard in presenting it in a very authentic way in those languages. And I hope that um, it, it reaches to as many audiences as possible. Thank you.